I do the most. Roll it, light it, then I choke. Pass it to my bitch, watch it choke. <laughs> Alright, so we back, and today we talking about the solo flares that are going on right now, today, as we speak. And the fact that the solo flares are going on, this brings us back to my other video of how this is a purpose for the chemtrails. Okay, let's talk about these solar flares and how these bad boys are flaring off and at the same time they're changing your DNA, your whole DNA structure. They are changing it, switching it up. So, the sun is throwing off flares and it's impacting the earth. It's impacting the way that the earth even moves, goes about, breathes, everything. It's impacting everything of that the earth has going on. While that's being done, at the same time, it's cleansing. It may look like destruction to some people. It may look like madness, chaos, murder, whatever you want to call it. It's cleansing. I'm going to start by saying this. We live in a dome, bro. Like, as of right now, we are in a dome. And I feel like we are in a dome only because we are being protected. And that's just what's going on from in here. But I feel like I, I know we're in a dome. I see a lot of hidden symbols a lot of things being done and said that shows that we're in the dome nobody's been out of space nobody's been out of space ain't no out of space ain't no fucking moon landing the moon landing was bullshit that's already proven that's already proven scariest moment of the journey Scariest. It didn't happen. It could have been scary. Certainly. I remember very clearly, I think anybody who was alive at the time does. I remember my parents waking me up and we went down and we watched you guys land on the moon. No, which you didn't. Was, no, you didn't. What? Because uh, uh, there wasn't any television, there wasn't anybody taking a picture. You watched animation. So you associated what you saw with. I have very hazy memories. Yeah, I know. Uh, well, well, no, but what we saw was we all we all were gathered around you the heard, old curved top heard radio me and listened. Talking about uh, you know how many feet we were going to the left and right, and then I said contact light, engine stop. It's exciting. Two other things, and then Neil said, "Houston, Tranquility Base, the Eagle has landed." That's just Man, how about that? That, that was that, very exciting. Not a bad line. Wow. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> this was, so were you? The moon landing was bullshit. That moon. And that sun is in your motherfucking orbit. There have been many attempts at these rockets. At these rockets. At these rockets. At these rockets. This is why fucking Elon Musk is so popular right now. Because of fucking rockets. And this has been their whole plan. They've been telling you this for almost 20. Longer than that. I'm, I know longer than that. Because I've been seeing it coming up. Rockets. All this bullshit, New World Order, all New World Order, all this bullshit. I've been seeing it, and I know you've been seeing it. I even seen the fucking sleeper hole. I know you've been seeing it coming up. And if not, then we lived in two different worlds. But what the fuck was I talking about? I don't like when I do that. But all this hate, all this evil, it's done. It's done for. All that is done for. It's done for. From here on out, it's just love. I don't care if you like it or not. I'm not going to take care of you. The universe is going to take care of you. And I'm sorry. Oh, yeah. So, nobody's been out of space. The sun ain't even out of space, bruh. Because they told you it's oxygen. There's no oxygen out of space, right? There's no oxygen. That's why we wear these... these these helmets, right? That's why the astronauts wear these helmets because there's no oxygen in space, right? So, how can it be a ball of fire with no oxygen? 
it is not a ball of fire that is just common sense this it, it's a big ball it's it, it, it's a big ball of plasma energy bro it's plasma energy it's just heat rubbing up it's just plasma energy bro and this is exactly what you are fucking plasma energy shout out to cootie b because i've been searching so fucking far and wide for this this uh video that eddie griffin was talking about he was talking about the firmament and they tell you and everything that the firmament that we live in a firmament even your precious fucking bible tells you that we live in a firmament and niggas be getting so fucking niggas be getting <laughs> It's crazy right now. Tesla. Yeah. Has blood on his hands. Yes, he does. A lot of, oh, yeah. a lot of it. And he wants to go to outer space. Just like every other thing. I need to go to outer space. What's out in outer space? And he never make it. He never make it. Rock shit hits the firmament, and the firmament stops it. Ain't nobody been to the moon. Ain't nobody been outside this giant cage that we're trapped in. The firmament is real. And that's level this is one why shit. rocket ships take off and they start shooting at an angle. They'll scrape the firmament and they always land in the ocean. Okay. You hear that shit? You hear that? Now, to get a little bit deeper. To get a little bit deeper. You understand what he said, right? We live in a fucking bowl, all right? All right, to get a little deeper, to get a little bit deeper. Now, listen to this. I, I know, I know we have still not shattered that highest and hardest glass ceiling, but someday someone will, and hopefully sooner than we might think, right? Baby speaking in code. She's speaking in code. The, the glass ceiling? The glass ceiling, you can't fucking crack. Somebody can't. <laughs> like, she's, she's speaking in code, bro. And that's all they fucking game is. Right. Up against the highest, hardest stained glass ceiling. Okay. Why you keep saying that, you stupid bitch? Why you keep saying that? We're not even about to make this about the firmament. We're about to make this, we making this about these solar flares. People, these people are fucking dying through, through heat, through heat, right? Like this happens every year, right? This summer thing happens every year, right? And it's been way hotter summers. It's been way hotter summers, bruh. And nobody just, pop, like, Bro, people's heads, <laughs> like I have never seen no shit like this. People's heads are fucking combusting, <laughs> combusting, like it's smoke coming out their head because it's, they can't, they, it's smoke coming out their heads because they can't stand this fucking, what's going on right now, these solar flares. And they should just shut down. They should just shut down. Sorry. Sorry to say it. I'm not doing it. Nature's doing it. I'm not doing it. I'm just I'm just a spectator of. I'm not doing it. I'm here with you. That's what they trying to do. They trying to block the fucking sun out. Bill Gates. F*** you. They trying to block the sun out. That shit not going to happen. And guess what? Not only is they trying to block the fucking sun out to drain us of more energy they putting a fake sun up like what the fuck is like what is that like do you not see how backward and stupid this shit is but but all of that shit is all that shit is done for all that shit is about to be stopped all that shit is done for your troops are dying off my boy they dying off but it ain't it ain't even it ain't even but 
All I'm saying is, get that ass outside in them flares, boy. It, it, it's so many TV shows that tell you to be scared of this shit. Don't be scared of shit. That's what they want. That's what's running this fucking matrix. Don't be scared of nothing. Get outside. Feel that sun. If you're doing wrong, nigga, take your shoes off and just fucking let go of all that negative energy, bruh. Get that sun. And... And honestly, after you do that, everything else gonna fall into place, bruh. And if not, come see me about it. But it's a wicked world we live in, man. They doing a lot of shit around us, and, and you can clearly see this shit if you pay attention. But a lot of us don't know what the fuck going on. But guess what? I'm one of those fuckers who knows what's going on, and that shit ain't about to ride. That shit is that shit is a, that shit is not about to ride. But I just wanted to touch on that and what's going on with that. Um I really don't promote myself much, I mean, but But, yeah. but that's about it, man. Um Okay, so and what I meant by if you come from the sun, one more thing. If you can go and stand in that sun all day and that sun don't burn you, you come from that sun. That sun is here to heal you. That sun is for you. You are supposed to be here. If you can sit in that sun all day, because if you cannot and you burn in that sun, I'm sorry. If you got to put on sunscreen to block what's organic to this planet, you got to put on something inorganic to... Attached to what's organic to this planet What'd that tell you? And not only that If you look at sunscreen And you put it in UV light Yeah Yeah That's what you get That's what you get So you tell me man You tell me man But that's about it, man. That's how I felt. Though. I just wanted to touch on that. I just wanted to touch on that, man. But that's about it for this one, man. I just wanted to touch on that. I just wanted to touch on these solar flares. I'll let y'all know what's up. So y'all just ain't out here blind. And even if you don't give a fuck, just don't give a fuck. You took the message. That's cool. But until the next one, ladies and gentlemen, hold it down. I do the most.